guys, Look we're together you. again. Look at you getting your hair. Look at you're I'm bougie. Th this is how I start my day. You don't start like this? Okay. Oh, you gotta start like this. Yeah, good. Yeah. Good. Start on your day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Sabrina. Yo. I'm happy to see you again. Happy to see you too. How you been? I'm, I'm what's been really the gossip? The go we got a lot You've been really about. good, but tell me what's been bad, okay? I, I know. <laughs> then turn you know, the I, work, you, I work on roast battles, so you gotta tell me what's been bad. Yes. Yo, can we talk about the style real quick? How you gonna how dare you come in? <laughs> coming super drippy right now. Can You're we talk dripping about too. If I'm gonna be with you, I gotta drip. <laughs> Let's talk about you. What's your what's what's the style? Like, how what was the inspiration? My wife is a wardrobe stylist. The inspiration is when you've got a wife that's a wardrobe stylist, you can't lose. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you it's can. like Friday Night Lights. You Full lose. closet, clear eyes, can't lose. Is that it? <laughs> yes. Is that how it goes? No. So look, I mean, I don't even know where to begin with you because when I first talked to you the first time, mm -hmm. you said, um, you you said I look like. You remember? I'm gonna yeah, say. Ah, wait. Who was it? Tell me again. Let me fix this. Hold you on. said. You said that I look like Kevin Federline's drug dealer. <laughs> look at everyone. Now you look like. Manny what's, Pac the what's the Manny name? What's the name? Sam Asgari, right? Who's that? Now Britney's mar married to Sam Asgari. Okay. Now you look like Sam Asgari's uh, trainer. Oh. Personal trainer. Oh wow, that that makes me That's feel. That's good. He's hot. That makes he me feel looks so good. good. You're doing good. Hey. You're climbing up in the world. Thank you. Yeah, you used to sell drugs to the bad one. Now you're now, now just, you're training the hot Persian one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm just sweating now, like worrying about my health. Yeah, but you look good. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. No, I what really appreciate that. What do you do for workouts? That. Um, uh, first of all, I really appreciate that because that was one thing I really um. Was it like insecure about man? Like really? Yeah, like especially you know being on camera all the time and you know you critique yourself so much. Mm -hmm. um, that was one of my things. So for you to recognize that and I haven't seen you in a while time like means a lot to me. Well, tell me what you're doing. Um, I'll do the same thing. I do Muay Thai maybe two to three times a week. Nice. And then I started running, but running is one of those things where like you don't just jump and do. No, you know have I mean? you read the book Running by Haruki Murakami? No. I've read about three books, and I won't shut the f up about them. Wait, so like, what is that it's about? It's actually called What I Think About When I Think About Running, I think. But it's just about sort of like the meditative aspects of running. OK. Yeah. Is, there some, is that where do you run? I run a little bit. It's like I such a mental thing. I ran thing. when I was reading it. Now I'm doing F45. Oh, are you? Yeah. Sorry, beast. Sorry, beast. No, that's hard. Like, F45 is tough. You've got the young lingo. Oh yeah, do I? You're a young guy, yeah. No, Whenever I hang I? out with you, I'm like, I'm not, I'm no longer young. No, 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 stop. How old am I, you think? I think you're 26. Do you guys agree with that? Yeah. I'm 31. Yeah, that's still young. I still feel it on my do you back, know the, Do you know the young words? Do you know Delulu? See, that's, that's not On TikTok, the kids are calling delusional Delulu. I hate it. I love it. <laughs> Delulu? I love it. Everyone's delusional and, and making it sound cute is just like, yeah, I'm Delulu. Delulu. I'm totally Delulu. Delulu is hilarious. I don't know any other words. Um, Riz? What's Riz? You don't ever heard of Riz? No. When someone says you got Riz? Riz is like the, the, the ability to put together words well and like, you know, chat to, to the... To, to Do you know what's got Riz? Who got it? What got Farming Riz? for love. Farming for Love, Sunday night, 7 p.m. on CTV. You're going to see a lot of Riz. Yo, Some people are going to be Delulu, but you're going to go Kukulu over this show. That was perfect. <laughs> that was actually perfect. Because, yes, uh, like on that show, you need to have you Riz. You got to have Riz. Okay, so I just learned the word, but you got to have it. You can't walk around with no Riz. Rizless? Yeah. Rizless in this world? Yeah, you got to have Riz w is the Riz. currency. Riz is the currency. Because, you know, the first episode starts out with these speed dates. If you don't right. have Riz in the speed date, how are you going to get to the farm? Oh my God, okay, hold do you on. Know, do you These even know how gonna this show eat, works? Uh, they're going to eat up what you just said, right? Like having Riz on this show is exactly, sorry, go on, what'd you say? Well, I'm saying, have you seen, did you see the first episode yet? I did. Be honest, you have time to catch up. You can go yeah. to ctv.ca and stream it. Okay. It is so awesome. Yeah. And it's the most successful dating show out there. Yes. All the other dating shows pretend they have Riz. No, Farming for Love has Riz. They've been doing it all over the world. 197 weddings. 480 kids. Shows made more kids than Nick Cannon. That's, I, I truly think this is the only dating show that has, has that record. I'm dying. No, true. True. That's hilarious. So wait, nine, how many weddings? 
four hundred and eighty kids, one hundred and ninety seven weddings. Wedding. And like still together now though? Still together I mean I'm That's sure like the four hundred and eighty kids I think is speaking to I don't know if the but a wedding's a wedding's a wedding, and we don't force them to get married at the end of it. That's the thing. The other shows are like, you know, gun to your head, you got to say yes by the end of this show experience. This is just teeing people up to be their authentic selves, meet other people who are, are nervously trying to find love as well. Mm -hmm. And it's so cute, it's so sweet. And I found myself calling the producers on my day off, being like, what's happening with Girleen? What's going on with Ashley? What's going on with them? What's yeah, that's time? awesome. Because, like, you got, you got kind of like, um, attached like to the the, the character because the they're really people. like they became friends and right. like you know when your friends are single you want them to to find, to find absolutely especially if they're looking if they're single and they want to find a partner a forever partner you want them to choose the right one